Hi guys, in my last video I created a levitating model of the interstellar space station which looked really cool. If you haven't watched that video then please watch it later. But now I want to talk about a problem. The problem with the levitating model is that it stops spinning after some time. It's because of the air friction and also because of some additional magnetic friction. This problem is demonstrated by the Action Lab, a very cool YouTube channel. They also demonstrated that the model stops spinning even inside the vacuum. So I wanted to create a model which can spin forever. So this is the model which I 3D printed. It has a place for holding the central magnet and also these four hands which will hold uh, some additional small magnets to add support to the central magnet and the upper part is for holding two additional strong magnets which will create a field perpendicular to the central magnet. So this way we can create magnetic fields in different directions at different levels and it will keep the model spinning forever. And here we can see that the levitating pencil uh, stopped spinning because of the air friction and also because of the additional magnetic frictions. So let's build our eternal spinning model. Okay, now let's test the model. As we can see that with this structure and uh, additional supporting magnets, it's relatively very easy to initiate the levitation. Without these supporting magnets, sometimes it can be very, very difficult to initiate the levitation because finding the exact levitating point is really hard and some levitating platforms are also not very stable. So with a very, very small push, it starts started spinning and it will continue spinning. I would not claim that it's a uh, 100% perpetual motion because internally there are feedback controllers which are reacting to the magnetic fields which I created in different uh, directions. Also to keep track of the time I'm putting my watch here and I will record the video for at least half an hour. Last time I let the model spin for almost three hours and it continued spinning with the same speed. To show that there is no external air force involved I'm putting a paper here and we can see that everything is still. So please leave your comments in the comment section and share your thoughts on how this model can spin eternally and also maybe some ideas on how we can utilize this method to create more interesting projects.